Keenan Chan holds here, West Virginia Land and Home Realty on uh, lots 93 and 94 in Ashton Woods. This is two lots combined that total 41.67 acres. And I'm up here at the, the building site. And as you can see, kind of looking south here uh, in the South Branch Mountain. So you're kind of not looking over the mountain, you're kind of looking into the mountain. Uh, but it's pretty cool. I mean, I think you can make it out through the trees there and <clears throat> This little the hollow down in here and the next ridge over it pretty much everything you're looking at here for the most parts part of the property uh, except for that far ridge uh, right over there, but There's a bunch of live lolly pines planted on the south side of this ridge up here, which are really pretty and uh, When you look back kind of to the north here up on this when you're up on this ridge top you're looking into sawmill mountain which is over that way so you kind of got a mountain in front of you and a mountain in the back of you but one of the main features of this lot is you can see there's about three inches of snow on the ground and my truck's sitting up here tells you one of two things this road up here is not that steep and or dodge pickups are pretty good uh but you got a road here already um this is an old logging road that runs from Ash and Woods Drive all the way through the property across this ridge. And it would take very little to convert this thing into your real driveway. I mean, this is what you're going to use as the driveway for this lot. So you're kind of saving big here. I mean, it's going to be minimal to get this thing up to snuff for a driveway. But if you started from scratch, this is probably a $25,000, $30,000 road up here. And... uh <sighs> out of breath getting old but anyhow the property goes back beyond my truck about another hundred yards and that's the end of it so i'm kind of all the way at the back well i say back i mean this direction on the property and uh these lobby pines like i said are planted on the south side of this ridge here and they're really pretty they come down easy for your build site but this is where you would build out in here but this property actually goes all the way over across Ashenwood Drive and fronts on Trough Road. Uh, so there's about eight acres of this 41 acres that lays on the other side of Ashenwood's Drive between there and Trough Road. And it's all flat hardwood forest. And you'll see that when you look at the plat. But I'm up here on top of this ridge, can't hear a thing, can't see another house, nothing. And I'm only... You know, as the crow flies, I'm not a quarter mile off the paved road right here. It's the first lots when you come through the west gate to Ashen Woods. So you have all this privacy, all this land, and you're only 10 minutes off a quarter H you, from Walmart. Well, from the town of Moorfield. You got Walmart, movie theater, car dealership, restaurants, the whole bit. But, uh, you know, a lot of these lots in here, you can drive back the subdivision roads for you know, 10, 15, 20 minutes before you get to your lot. That's not the case with this one. Um, I mean, you even got a good view kind of looking more that direction. But uh, there's power, perked. Both lots have been perked. The power's right there at the road. There's fiber internet along the road here at this lot, so through HardyNet. So I don't know what you're waiting on, but if you want to build a nice uh, full-time home cabin, if you just want a hunting property where you can camp and ride ATVs, I mean, you could see how this property rolls. I mean, it rolls, but none of it's what I would call steep. I mean, you know, you can walk around this thing and it's not going to kill you. But uh, come check this one out. And also right here, another thing, five minutes any direction, you're at public access on the south branch of the Potomac River. So if you want to fish, canoe, kayak, swim, all that's really close.